In this video, I'm going to show you how to make a splash screen, and a splash screen is nothing more than a form that pops up for two to three seconds, allowing your users to see uh, who's responsible for the application or, or whatever information you'd like to put on the splash screen. I've created a form here called, I'm going to call it splash screen, so let me just rename it to uh, splash screen. And if you open it up, you'll notice that it's just something that says splash screen. And I've got to clean this up a little bit, so I've got to go to the form properties. I've got to take out the record selector and the navigation bar and maybe clean up the little title here. So let's do that real quick. Uh, I'm going to hit design on the form. Go to the properties icon here, and I'll go to all. I'm going to hit uh, border style none. And that's basically going to give me allow me to have a professional looking splash screen. If I save it and I test it, this is what my splash screen is going to look like. So that gives me a nice clean square that will show up for about three seconds and then go away. So I'm going to right click, hit form design and close it out. So now how do I make it pop up and then go away? Select the form, hit design and then we'll go to the properties here and go to the event uh, section of the form. Now the events section of the form, if you scroll all the way down, you'll notice that you'll see on timer and then timer interval. I have the timer interval set to 3000. That means that this form will show up for 3 seconds. If I wanted to show up for 10 seconds or 5 seconds, let's say, I would show it up for 5000. So 3 th seconds is fine, so I'm going to show it up for 3 seconds. Now I've got to set an on timer event or else it won't do anything. So on my timer, I want to go ahead and select the code builder and on timer I want to do a do command close form splash screen and that's basically the command that I'm going to put in there and if I close it out and save it if I open it up, it's going to come up and form, come on for three seconds and go away. Okay, so that's great. That's the first step. Now I want to basically ensure that this main form opens up when I uh, open up my splash screen. So I'm going to hit design again. I'll go to properties, event, and I'm going to go to on timer procedure. And after this splash screen is open, I want to do a do command, open form, um, form main. Normal, and that's fine. And now, when I save this, open up my splash screen, it's going to come on for three seconds and then open up the main form. Perfect. Now, what we can do is we can make sure that when our application starts up, our splash screen comes up first in order for this effect to work. So, what we can do is go to Tools, Startup and then go to display form page and select splash screen so that means the splash screen will display first and we have done it so when the user opens up our database we can uh, see that the splash screen comes up first for three seconds then our user form pops up and our application has the effect that we want it to do good stuff